Butterfly conservation's Big Butterfly Count is one of the most exciting, rewarding and fun pieces of citizen science that you can do, and we would very much like you to do it. How? Well, you've got to pick a spot, and it could be anywhere. It can be your window box, it could be the corner of a car park at work, it could be a nature reserve, it could be, of course, your garden. Once you've picked that spot, we would like you to spend 15 minutes there counting the butterflies that you see. But not just any old butterfly, those that we've got on our list, on our sheet this year. So you can go to the website, you can download a hard copy of the sheet so you can see them all at once. And there are a range of relatively familiar and common species. If you've got any problems identifying them, then there's lots more information available on that website. And they're not just butterflies, as you'll notice, there are a few day-flying moths in there as well. If you want to keep up to date with the latest technology, download the app and then you can upload all of the data that you collect in the same way. But whatever, we want that data. That data is really important to us as butterflies are a very important part of our ecosystems, holding an influence over many other species, things like nesting birds, mammals, bats of course. Now, you've got three weeks to do this and you can do it as many times as you like, but there's one last thing. What about if you have a really bad day, a really bad 15 minutes? What about if you don't see hardly any butterflies? What about if you see zero butterflies? We still want that data. Negative data, the zero, is just as important as the 15, 20, 30, maybe even 50 butterflies that you might see. When we get that data, we'll crunch it and it will give us a much better idea of what's happening to the distribution and populations of our butterflies and moths here in the UK. And armed with that information, our conservationist will make the UK a better place for our butterflies. And wouldn't that be a good thing? Thank you.